Hey guys, welcome back to the shop. Today I'm going to be working on the fuel delivery system for the four-wheel motorcycle. So let me explain what I've got here. The reason I have this in here um, in line with the fuel line is because the fuel tank I have here, it has this flat bottom and the outlet is on one end of it, not in the middle. So I'm worried about if I, I'm going like down a hill, the, the gas will shift to the front of the tank and then not back here. So then this will just be sucking in air from the, from the fuel pump. But if I have this in there, this will hold some amount of gas um, always right here and there'll always be gas at the bottom of this thing pretty much no matter how I tilt this. So I won't have to worry about air um, coming to the inlet. Even if there is air up here um, for a little bit, this will still hold enough gas um, probably for, for a long enough time um, for me to work with that. So then the outlet comes out of here, back over here to the fuel pump and you can see I have this thing here hooked right up to the valve cover. This pipe there, this is the inlet, so that'll come around. 
and then the outlet right there goes around into the carburetor. Another thing with these two pieces I have on the end here, um, these are, as you saw, out of aluminum. This is aluminum, so I'll be eventually welding these to there around this, around here to make a good seam. But my TIG welder is out of gas right now, so I can't weld those right now, but eventually I will. So that's the fuel delivery system. The other thing I want to do for the gas tank eventually is um, put some proper um, liner in it just to make sure there's no leaks or anything or cracks. Um, so that's probably something I'll do eventually, but it's a small update for today. Um, I've been really busy recently, so I haven't had tons of time to work on this, but that's the fuel setup I have on there. Um, I think it'll work. The only thing I'm worried about a little bit is if this fuel pump is too big, because um, it is off of a bigger engine. Uh, I think it's off of a 20 something horsepower engine, but we'll see how that works eventually. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.